I want our NHS to be the safest and most caring healthcare system anywhere in the world, and nurses are fundamental for that. Uh, we now have 8,000 more nurses in our hospitals uh, compared to five years ago, and we are tackling the short staffing that happen at mid staffs. But going forward, the real need now is for uh, more nursing in the community, more district nurses, more practice nurses, more community nurses. I want to value the really important work that nurses do in the community and make sure that we are able to treat every single older person with dignity, respect, and the highest standards of compassionate care, something I know every single Labour will value and respect the nursing workforce. We'll begin immediately by increasing the number of training places from this September as part of our plan to recruit 20,000 extra nurses. That's the only way we can break the hold of the staffing agencies over the NHS. We will reinstate the independent pay review body to bring fairness back to pay. We will protect the unsocial hours payment for NHS staff, but more than anything, we will restore the right values back to the heart of the health service that matter so much to nurses. Integration over uh, fragmentation, collaboration before competition, people before profits. You are committed to providing 20,000 more nurses and 3,000 more midwives and for increasing the number of training places for UK nurses. There used to be, I think, 23,000 nurses trained a year, but this figure has been cut. Um, we also would like to bring in uh, Earn As You Learn uh, for the state enrolled nursing that we used to have years ago, and it would be possible for health care assistants to train towards this and also to continue their career progression by working on the board towards an SRA. The really critical thing for nurses is that we ensure that we make the necessary investment in the NHS and the Liberal Democrats are the only party to have committed to the £8 billion uh, funding gap that it will have exist by 2020 and to have demonstrated where the money is coming from and beyond that we want a non-partisan commission set up this year straight after the election to engage with clinicians, the public, trade unions and patient groups to ensure that we achieve a new settlement for the NHS to ensure it is sustainable and that nurses have a good future in the NHS.